Okay, so I just want to um, show you uh, the Irish stew at this point, okay? It's had 45 minutes cooking, right? So if you remember, the potatoes haven't gone in before now. So the carrots and celery and um, barley and everything are in, but the potatoes haven't gone in, right? So take it out of the oven or take it off the hob. I've had mine in the oven um, because I've been using the hob for other stuff. So you can casserole on the hob or you can casserole in the oven, whichever you prefer. Um, just take it out and pop your potatoes in. Now, I don't like too many potatoes in this stew, but if you love potatoes, put in twice the amount. I'm going light on the potatoes. I've used four decent sized um, white potatoes peeled. Um, I sometimes use baby potatoes in an Irish stew instead. Uh, whatever you have, whatever you like. Um, because I have these um, white potatoes, I want to use them up, so that's what I've used. So I just pop them in. I make sure they're submerged in the stock. I'm going to pop them back into the oven for the next 45 minutes or so, okay? And at that point, I'm going to check my lamb is cooked. The potatoes will have broken up a little bit, which will thicken up the stew because it's still quite watery here. But that those potatoes, they're there for flavour and they're there for thickening. And I'm going to make it nice and thick. And then when it's cooked, we'll chop some nice parsley into it. 